disguise myself as General Sal and steal the Veiled Bride during the wedding ceremony? Yeah, make sure the whole gang's there. Okay, I I'm headed to the rendezvous now. Over and out. Sly Cooper and his secret plans. Who's this Veiled Bride he's so interested in anyways? Well, he's not the only one who can play the disguise game. I'll give him and his gang a shotgun wedding they'll never forget. What strange rumbling have disturbed my meditation, and on the very eve of my wedding? Do not worry, my bride. I will not let anything prevent our love from blossoming. Not even your misguided attempts to escape. Ah, well. Perhaps my meditation will be more focused amid the splendor of my treasure temple. Jane King. We're in the van, waiting for the treasure and escape. Hey, Murray, Sal's on his way to your position. How'd you come in with the treasure? We're doing awesome! Stand aside, Penelope! Cannonball! No way! Uh-oh. Okay, guys, parachute down the treasure to me. I'm ready! Thank <laughs> you. 
family temple destroyed. Never have I suffered such an outrage. You shall pay. Eat it thou. I broke your temple, and I'll break your face for messing with the Cooper gang. You cannot hurt me. Oh, yeah? Heads up, Emily. Treasure chest coming down. The outrage. Stone dragon of the temple. I summon you from rock to flesh. Aid the family power in this hour of need. Sweet strawberry shortcake. No, let's go, Lucy. Ha ha! The town line is master in this place. Hear me, Sly Koopa. My lineage surpasses yours in every way. It's not about the family name, pal. It's what you do with it. Sly, I'm okay. General Sal had his wedding right on schedule. Everything was as he'd arranged, except the bride came as kind of a shock. Carmelita was a little disappointed it wasn't me she busted at the altar, although I doubt she minded taking Sal into custody. He did, after all, plague the streets with the undead. From what I hear, the locals were happy to see him go. We dropped off Jean King with her aunt. The Panda King insisted that she be safe there and that he needed to pay off his debt to the gang. I was still wary, but there was no denying that his skills would come in handy. Needless to say, we lived it up in the back streets of Shanghai. What kind of gang of thieves would we be if we passed up on recreation like that? Thank you. 